on Bedford Road in Limerick to remember Savita Halapanavar who passed away last month in the University Hospital in Galway. She passed away because she was, didn't have access to an abortion even though it was clear that her fetus was never going to survive and due to the fact that her cervix was open for so long she contracted septicemia and unfortunately died. This woman died in the hospital in a supposedly modern country um, because the government refused over the past 20 years to legislate for the X case which left the legal vacuums which meant she was refused the medical help that was, could have saved her life so she spent two or three days in agony and I think that's absolutely disgraceful and it's just backwards it's something we should be reading about from the archives of history not something that happened three weeks ago it very disturbed very when I heard about it and I felt like so this poor woman struggled for three days looking for her help she was obviously in immense pain and the doctors weren't willing to help her because we're perceived to live in a Catholic country but I mean this is a multicultural country We've been brought up Catholic, yeah, but at the end of the day, if you have a person obviously near death's door because of the situation she's in, she should be given all the support and the aid that she can get there and then. And I also think that because she was an organiser of an Indian festival in Galway and it was cancelled because she died, that's probably the only reason we heard of her. There might be more women who die like that. Um, that we don't hear about and that's too many and there shouldn't be any more and that has to change and I think that's that's why everyone came in. Here in Ireland it had took like a family that you know came into the country to, to, to highlight this and we're here for years and, and, and we can't even get our own government to listen to us and it happens to, to you know it's just you know we're the one community but I'm just saying like you know if if this happened in the US or if this happened in in any part of the, of, of the globe, it'd be open lights. She was only 31 years old. That's younger than me, that's younger than a lot of people here are the same age. And what people have been saying to me today is it could have been any one of us, it could have been any one of us that died due to the lack of legislation. This legislation has been promised for years. At least five governments have just kicked the can down the road, down the road, down the road, and now a 31-year-old is dead because of their lack of action.